Hello everyone, thank you for joining me today for this talk entitled An Innovative Product that goes beyond the concepts of pre, pro and postbiotics. As you may know, I'm Marco Ruggero, I hold an MD and PhD, and this product I talk about is called OneVar, the one and only panbiotic. And the talk and the product are made exclusively for Dana Biologics and Mr. Choi Yuk. Before we start, please allow me to introduce myself. I obtained my MD in 1980 in Florence, Italy. I have a PhD in molecular biology and a specialization in diagnostic radiology. As a young postdoc, I worked at Burroughs Welcome in 1984 in North Carolina, USA, and later as visiting scientist at the National Cancer Institute of the NIH in Bethesda, Maryland, since 1987. Later, I was appointed professor of molecular biology at the University of Firenze, or Florence if you prefer, in Italy, in 1992, where I worked until 2014. I am the founder of Silver Spring, a Swiss company specialized in research and development of innovative approaches and products, including one VAR, the product I'm talking about today. Over the course of my scientific career, I published more than 240 scientific articles, co-authored, among others, by scientists such as Eduardo Lapetina, Stu Aronson, Jackie Pierce, Peter Duesberger, Henry Bauer, the late Dr. Jeff Brestreet, Dietrich Lingard. One of my articles was sponsored by Nobel laureate Sir John Vey. My current research interests are in immunotherapy, oncology, and neurosciences. Also, before we start, please remember that no information in this talk is presented as medical advice. Standard of care for every disease must be followed, as well as rules and regulations established by health authorities. I wish to disclose my conflict of interest that is uh, quite evident here, because I have designed a number of protocols and approaches to different diseases, and I developed the product, one of our, and the approaches mentioned in this talk. I wish to thank Mr. Choi Yuk of Dana Biologics for his priceless support. This talk is for him, this product is for him and his company. And also I wish to thank all those who will watch this video for the attention that they will want to give to this presentation. So, what is one VAR? What makes one VAR? Essentially, there are five components. Because one VAR is an original entire ecosystem with self-assembling supramolecular structures. The components are zinc, an essential mineral, a proprietary culture of prokaryotes and eukaryotes with their theater of activity, a long chain sulfated polysaccharide, LCSP, of digital origin endowed with GCMAF-like activity. More on GCMAF later. And then there are two botanical extracts. The first one is a botanical extract with known anti-inflammatory, immune-modulating, anti-cancer, antioxidant properties. Then there is a second botanical extract that contains a natural free phenolic compounds, fibers, macro and micro nutrients with known anti-inflammatory, immune-modulating, anti-cancer properties and known to rebalance sugar and lipid metabolism. Sure. Another important point is that one VAR is designed according to a proprietary, highly innovative procedure that optimizes molecular interactions between its uh, uh, four or five components, so to increase their respective activities. In other words, one VAR is not the result of the addition of the activities of its five components, but the result of the multiplication of the activities of its five components. In other words, if the biological activity of each individual component of one VAR were 10, the overall activity of the self-assembled components would be 10 by 10 by 10 by 10, 100,000. 
rather than 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10 that makes 50. In other words, its activity is 100,000 versus 50. This synergism is obtained at the molecular level through carefully calibrated interactions associated with the distribution of charges on the surface of molecules, leading to self-assembly of entirely original supra and super-supramolecular structures years ago. And now let's move to another component, the first botanical extract that has known anti-inflammatory, immune-modulating, anti-cancer, antioxidant properties. It has been shown to have anti-cancer properties. It can prevent the development of certain types of cancer, such as lung cancer, breast cancer, and colon cancer. It may help with weight loss. It uh, can help boost metabolism and increase fat burning. As far as brain health is concerned, it has been shown to improve brain function. It can improve memory, learning, and cognitive function. It may also improve heart health. It can help reduce the risk of heart disease, stroke, and high blood pressure. And it's also a good source of antioxidants. Antioxidants help protect the body against the damage from free radicals. And also contains a number of hydrophobic compounds, which are compounds that are not soluble in water. These compounds include catechins. These are polyphenols. They have a number of health benefits, including cancer prevention, weight loss, and improved brain function. Flavonoids, other type of polyphenols that have antioxidant protection and improved heart health. Triterpenes or triterpenes that are types of lipids that have anti-inflammatory, anti-cancer properties. Lignans, these are plant compounds have a number of health benefits, antioxidant protection, improved cholesterol level. Now, the hydrophobic compounds in this uh, first botanical extract that composes one var, these are responsible for many of its health benefits because these compounds are able to penetrate cell membranes. So they go inside the cells and protect the cells from damage. And they also have anti-inflammatory and antioxidant properties. And then there is a second botanical extract that contains natural free phenolic compounds, fibers, macro and micronutrients with known anti-inflammatory, immune-modulating, anti-cancer properties and known also to rebalance sugar and lipid metabolism. This is a second botanical extract exerts multiple functions in the context of one var. On one side, it contains a number of bioactive molecules that interact with each other and with the other components of one var in a synergistic way, potentiating each other's efficacy. On the other side, it confers a prebiotic properties to the formula of one var. And finally, it serves the purpose of a backbone. It is a docking structure where the other components of one var are assembled in a supramolecular configuration. Because of these features, it is abbreviated in a BBSS, Botanical Backbone Supramolecular Structure. Now, again, I don't want uh, to be boring uh, with these uh, molecular structures, but just to give you an idea of how they interact. This is uh, the long chain sulfated polysaccharide and these are the electrostatic interactions with the BBSS, the botanical extract. And then we go to much more complex structures that self-assemble in our bodies when we ingest the one var. And so this is a very complex uh, triple bilayer with a zinc atom at the center. Of course, again, this is not in scale. This is just to give you an idea and I don't want to go into many biochemical details because I know that molecular biology can be very boring. I've been teaching molecular biology for some 20 years. I know it can be boring. I don't want to bore you to death, but I just want to tell you that we know perfectly well the molecular interaction between all the components of one VAR, and this is how one VAR has been designed. 